Here we have a Volkswagen that has a faulty fuel rail pressure sensor. We're going to take a look at how to read the codes on that and then we'll show you where that sensor is located on the engine. So you will need to use an OBD2 scanner that can read fault codes from the engine control unit. In this case we have this scanner right here. We're under control unit and we're going to go to read DTCs or read diagnostic trouble codes. So once you select read DTC, you can see here we have three fault codes. Now these two codes are passive stored uh, so we don't need to worry about them at this time. But uh, you see an active code and that's fuel rail pressure, pressure sensor, a circuit. So let's take a look and see where that sensor is located on the engine. So we come here to the side. If you look down, down there. See this right here? That is the fuel pressure sensor. And because it's a circuit issue, in this case, it could be the sensor itself. But it could be the wire harness or it could be the connector to it. So if we check, you want to check that. And it seems like it's loose, so I want to reconnect this. You want to make sure that that's clicked. Press in until it clicks like you just heard. And once that, you want to read the codes again. Make sure that code change from stored. Make sure that code change from active to a stored or a passive code. And once it does, then you can go ahead and clear the check engine light. 